Hello guys, my name is Brittany. Welcome to my channel. Today I am back with another Sims 4 build. I will be doing the whole, ho whole house is one color and this time I spun the wheel and it landed on black. So I will be making an all black house. I actually, there's like a like quite a bit to choose from um, that I liked and I really like how this turned out. Um, as you can see here, I'm just like trying to figure out the layout of the house, um, what would work the best. I do end up making some arrangements here with like the layout, uh, roofs. Ro the roofs are quite hard <laughs> to do in Sims. Um, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but they just aren't always the easiest. But with this house, I did go more for, like, um, I guess, like, witchy vibes. Because there's the spell ca casters in it, and I kind of went in with that. Um, I haven't played much with, like, the spell ca casters. I don't know why, because, like, uh, mm, I don't like the loading screens of having to go back and forth to the realm um but i do definitely want to play more with it i guess that i just haven't played with the realm of magic because um i just I don't have any sims that i feel like would be spellcasters but you know who knows i mean it could show up in my sim series that i'm playing but here's the kitchen i really like how the kitchen turned out i liked that there were quite there are a lot of options for um like kitchen wear <laughs> kitchen decor that was black so that was very good also like the walls the um black wall colors wallpaper paint whatever it is i like a lot of them like i think it probably is mostly the paranormal pack like that is a very cute pack and then also like as i was finishing this up cottage living was released so i was able to add some of that um outside but again like with this there are some that i would not consider black i don't know how the sims team whoever decides what the color is i don't know how they decide that but I, there's just some stuff that i would not consider black on this so i when was it i don't even know at some point during the building i was like i could make this like a spell caster house house for a spell caster maybe i could have like a basement that has the um cauldron down there but I wasn't able to fit in a basement, so I ended up deciding to go with an upstairs. And it, like the, how do I explain this? Like I kind of made it look kind of like the attic was a room, except like you don't get the slanted walls. Honestly, I don't know if you can do that. If you can, I don't know how to. Um, but I was, I really like that room. I surprisingly had like a lot to choose from. Um, there's just like there, like I think the vampire. I really stuck to the vampire, paranormal, realm of magic. I don't think there were any other pet. I think those were like the main packs that I stuck to. Um, because that they just have like that kind of spooky um magical stuff <laughs> so i think this is pretty much how the layout of the house is um i was where the bedroom is i was trying to make a basement in there it just wasn't working um so i decided okay we'll just put a bedroom here um and i really like how it turned out it looks really good like i i like that the blacks that they have aren't like the same shade of black because like with black like it's like you know there's not many different colors like you end up getting to gray i mean it's like a gray scale um 
but I was really surprised with how many options like that plant that is not black <laughs> but I I really like it I like the different tones of black different shades whatever it's called I don't know <laughs> but there is just a lot of stuff that like fit really well with um what I was going for which I guess I just ended up being lucky. I will definitely be continuing these. I want to, I like making them. I think it gives me, I use the same curtains. Wow. <laughs> the same curtains in the kitchen and in the bedroom. But I will, I really like making these. I feel like it challenge, challenges me to make a building. I don't know if I'll continue with a house. Um, maybe I'll do like, a gym or a bar <laughs> i'm trying to think of what other like places they can go to um just like other uh what is the word public spaces i don't think that's what it is in the sims but yeah i i really enjoy making these so i will definitely go down the list of colors using the wheel um, delete in the colors that I've already used so whenever I make the next one um, I will remove black from the list and I did actually make the black house on the same lot as the greenhouse so I was just I had extra room so I was able to just fit another a whole nother house on here um, one thing that I did really want to add were trees like surrounding the house, but there were no black trees or plants that could go outside, so I could not add that. I really wanted to, but it didn't work. I ended up finding a... I, I wanted to do the trees more as like a privacy thing um, that would then kind of be like the house is hidden you don't really know much about the person that lives here and um like it could just be that it the per you just don't know about the person because like everything is blocked off you can't really see into the um building at all the house <laughs> Like, you just don't know much about them, and I feel like I wanted to do that to play in with the, like, they're a spellcaster. I keep wanting to say which, but they're called spellcasters in the game. So as you can see here, I just made the upstairs room, which is kind of like where the cauldron, no, the cauldron isn't in the room. I was going to do that, <laughs> but I ended up moving it, but, um... Yeah, just like that. I would not say that floor is black. I don't know why they do this. And the fences, like, I feel like this fence is too low to be, like, for, like, a kind of, like, a balcony. I feel like it should be higher. I think that if that was in real life, someone could easily fall over that. <laughs> I I wanted something a bit taller. I could, I guess I could have used, like, a half bowl. But at the same time, I kind of wanted to go with the fence because I feel like that would make it more interesting. But yeah, just starting on starting on the top here. I do eventually make this room wider because there just wasn't room. See so there, there we go. And that light is so big. <laughs> that that roof that I'm fixing here, I do end up making it like all like a clear roof so that what do we call the sunroof like the roof is completely clear like there see it's like that just to get some natural lights in there and because the roof just wasn't working it, it wasn't working <laughs> i really like how this top room came out i like how much clutter there is i was able to add a lot of stuff which just makes like houses look more lived in like when you add a bunch of clutter stuff or decor it just looks like it it's lived in like it has some personality to it so i really enjoy doing that um and there were a lot of uh, options for this house or this room <laughs> 
I think, like, like I said before, it's all due to like the vampires, realm of magic, and paranormal packs. They just really fit the theme. And in some counters here to put some like plants and other miscellaneous <laughs> items that I could find move the cauldron outside and change it out for that black kind of more basic looking one just because I think it fits better with the outside and then I add a seance table is that what it's called in here I do change the chairs like that table that's not black the chairs aren't black I mean the table I guess kind of is it's like a gold but I do put some black chairs right there I put black chairs and I just with that I'm just like what that's not black. Those chairs are not black. So just add in a bunch of the decor. Continuing this challenge, I don't know what color I am looking forward to the least. I don't know. Because like, I don't know. I don't use... I don't, do I? I don't like yellow or orange, but I feel like I use those... I think I use orange quite a bit in some of my builds. Just because I like how... like Not really like orange-orange, more of like a peachy orangish <laughs> color um i just like how that looks with the wood uh so that i think is kind of recurring probably not looking forward to yellow i just uh, yellow is not my favorite color i don't like yellow oh maybe there's not a lot of pink either we'll find out when those colors come uh working on the outside here i wanted a tall fence that kind of gave privacy that the privacy that i wanted to do with the trees but couldn't get because there are no black trees and like that tall one i'm just like is that a little ridiculous because that fence gives the tall one in the back that gives a lot of privacy that i wanted like it's tall you can't see into it but like is that ridiculous <laughs> and then of course there aren't any gates that work with that fence um so i just decided to go with this fence no gates you can only get to this area through the door and it's just like a nice little area i just add in some of this stuff i feel like now i could have looking back watching this back i could have added some like i could have made the grass more kind of like have some dirt spots make it look not so kept up and i think that if this house was on a lot of its own I would have um, made like a walkway to it, but there's the greenhouse there and I kind of wanted to keep it separate from each other, so no walkway. But I don't know if these builds are working, like I don't know if they're playable, because uh, you know, it's a do BB move objects and I think it's fine, I don't think I did anything that would make it not i guess it would just be the placement of some things like in the second floor the seance table um like i don't know if you can get around it i believe this is everything like i said before i will be continuing this i don't know when the next sims series episode will be because with the update i lost a lot of my cc so they're kind of naked <laughs> Um, I don't know how I lost it, but I usually forget to remove my mods folder when I update. This time I remembered to move it out onto like the desktop. I did that. And then when I bring it back in after it's done updating, a lot of it was gone. <laughs> Which sucks. <laughs> I can't find Sheila's hair or Afu's hair. So they're both bald. A lot of their clothes are missing. I just don't know where it is. It's gone. So I have a problem with that. <laughs> but yeah, I'll probably go back and like update them a little bit. They could be updated. But yeah, there's my all black house. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.